In this pivot video, we're going to talk about the HOA functionality. Now HOA stands for handoff auto. And on our older panels, you would have normally seen like a, like a paddle switch on the circuit board back here somewhere. And it was, it was often kind of hard to read what position the paddle switch was, was in. Um, and you would flip it to on, uh, the on position or hand position, and that would run the pump. So you'd hear the, you'll hear the contactor clunk, and that means the pump has been pro provided power and, and the pump is running. And then in, in the off position, uh, it just means that even if the switches came up, the float switches came up in the pit, the pump wouldn't turn on. So it's a way to keep it, to keep it safe. One of the disadvantages of that older style HOA is that you could accidentally leave a pump running or leave a pump off and go home, the Servitec would go home and, and not realize it. And then there's an even bigger problem. Uh, with either a burned out pump or a, a pump that needed to turn on but couldn't because it was in the wrong mode. So what we've done with these HOAs is we call them smart HOAs is that you can toggle with this button right here through the modes and what we'll do is you may or may not be able to see me doing this but when you push the button well I pushed it twice to go to hand I don't know if you heard the contactor pull in uh, but that's that would mean the pump is running. I'm gonna turn it off, put it back to auto. I'll put it back in hand again by pressing the button twice. One, two. So the contactor clicks. It's now in hand mode, so the pump is running. And what, the way we've done this is we've set it up so that by default, the pump running in hand will occur for five minutes. And then it'll turn off on its own and return to auto. Now if the if the service tech wants to run it for another five minutes, they can just put it back in hand and turn it off when they need to, or they can go through the menu system and adjust how long that pump run time will be. So I'm gonna put it back to auto. So it's hand off auto, right? So the other, the middle section here is off. So if I put it to off, you notice the red light comes on indicating that it's in off, and that's gonna go, that. It's off now forever, but what, what'll happen is in four hours by default, the alarm will go. And that's just a, a reminder alarm that the panel is in off. Now you can change that number too in the screen if you want it to be for eight hours or 12 hours or 72 hours or whatever it is. You can change it so that you don't get that alarm for a set amount of time. Or, I'm gonna put it back to auto, if I, if I go into off and just hold the button for about six seconds, the LED will blink red instead of solid red. And now off is off permanently and there will be no alarm. So that's the whole, that's the idea um, of the smart HOA is to try to prevent accidentally leaving it on or off, which can cause either property damage or pump burnouts. Um, and this is all fully described in the uh, instruction document, so you can use the QR code here to, to find those instructions if, if you don't have it already.